Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Edmond Mindaros, and for today's quick tutorial, and I'm going to show you guys on how to resolve the unexpected error that you are experiencing in the Windows Defender applications. Sorry, we ran into a problem. Please try again. And without further ado, and let's go ahead. So first thing I recommend doing would be if you have any other third-party antivirus or anti-software running on your computer, I recommend to temporarily turning off or disabling real-time protections for that antivirus software and then attain the actions you're having the issues with it, Windows Defender. So all you have to do is to open up on a search menu and then type on lang dito yung our registry editor and then next ka lang mag right click and that select to run as administrator and before you proceed in the registry i would suggest you to create a backup file so that anything go wrong you can easily restore back in order to create a backup file so dito lang sa taas i select mo lang dito yung file and that select dito yung export so dito sa export registry file select ka lang dito kung saan mo isisave yung file and then next kailangan mo mag create ng file name mas maganda kung lagyan mo to ng date and then next, click mo lang tong save. Okay, so proceed na tayo. So, ang next step, ay kailangan mo lang select dito yung HK Local Machines. Click mo lang tong arrow na to para mag-expand. And then next, select mo lang dito yung software. And then dito sa software, scroll down at select mo lang dito yung policy. Okay, so i-click mo lang tong policy. And then next, ay select mo dito yung Microsoft. So, click mo lang tong arrow na to para mag-expand on it. So, dito sa Microsoft, and then select mo lang dito yung Windows Defender, okay? So, i-click mo lang siya, and then dito sa empty space, kailangan mo mag-right click, select yung new, and then select mo lang dito yung DWORK 32-bit value. And then dito ay kailangan lang natin mag-rename, okay? So, kailangan lang natin ilagay itong name na disabled anti-spireware, okay? So, kailangan mo i-type or i-rename itong disable anti-spyware and then press mo lang yung enter and then dito ay kailangan mo lang mag double click and then lalabas itong kanyang edit viewer 32 bit value and then next step dito na sa value data kailangan mo maglagay dito na 0 and then click mo lang tong ok and then dito sa base select mo lang dito yung hexadecimal and then click ok and then next ay kailangan lang natin mag uh, exit dito sa registry and then dito sa start menu kailangan mo nang select dito nyo restart. Okay, so ganoon lang po kasimple kung paano natin i-fix ang unexpected error in Windows Defender. Okay, so please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel for more quality content. Thank you guys and see you in my next tutorial.